Today we're going to cover how to save favorites, how to place favorites, modify favorites that you've already saved. We'll also go over the easiest way to import and export favorites from one project to another project. Let's say we want to save this fridge as a favorite so that we can use it later on. If we go up to window, then go to palettes, and as we go down the palettes, we'll see favorites. Now a little shortcut, if we just go to palettes and then type the letter F, it'll automatically open up that palette. A little shortcut. So now to save the favorite, all we need to do is press this little star button in the bottom left hand corner. So we'll go new favorite and it'll prompt us to give it a name. So if we call it fridge one and then go okay. We've now got our fridge saved in our favorites. And now if we go to the object tool and just next to the settings dialog, if we hit this little button just on the right here, we can now select our fridge. We can always search for it, FRI for fridge and then hit enter. Now from here, all I need to do is click and we've got the fridge. But let's say we wanna make some adjustments to the materials. If we select the fridge and go Control T, it's going to bring up the object's settings. From here, if we go to 3D representation and surfaces, let's change these to say a paint, like a gloss white. I'll do this for all the materials and then go OK. From here, if I deselect, I'll see that the fridge is now all white. If I want the default fridge in my favorites, this one just up here, to now have those materials we just applied, all we need to do is make sure that the fridge is selected then right click the fridge just up here. All we need to do is go redefine. And now this fridge, if we hit deselect, double click our fridge and then place our fridge down, it's now going to do it with those new materials. If we wanted to quickly change the materials, we can just go surface just up here and make sure that the surface is selected to one that we want. Let's say we go white, paint flat white, and I click on this one, it's going to paint all the surfaces of the fridge just that one time. Now to import and export your favorites from project to project, it's actually really easy. All we need to do with this favorites dialog opened up is go to this little settings clog just up the top right hand corner. We'll go import and export. From here, it looks pretty self-explanatory, but if we say go import and we wanna bring in those favorites from the other ARCHICAD file, even though we might be in the right file that we want, it mightn't show up, but all we need to do is go on to file of types, then select all ARCHICAD projects just here. And with that, our ARCHICAD file that we want to import our favorites from is now showing. So if we click on this and then go open, it's going to show up this settings dialog. This is actually really helpful because we can now choose if we want to delete all the favorites existing in the file that we've already got. We do this by just clicking on this bottom right portion here. It'll say import, or it'll say delete all before the import. So if I wanna keep this fridge that I've already done up, but I wanna import all these other favorites, I can just click on import. Or if I wanna delete the fridge, then I'll just go delete all before import. And now it's brought in all those favorites from that project. I'm going to put this kitchen file on the Patreon for free. No trial needed. So you can download it and get an idea of how much quicker it is to use a room that's already been set up. This is one of the many modules in the fundamentals template. If you want to get all the room modules along with example files, legends, schedules, and more, early access is now available for purchase. Now, speaking of examples, in this video just over here, we redraw a building from the 1800s from scratch, then render it in twin motion. You don't want to miss out on this one. 